So I definitely understand uh, much longer time being put into filming than the actual video turns out. Yeah. You could probably take one of our shows down to a two and a half minute corn dog moment. <laughs> that's what the corn dog moments are, right? Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, that's that's all it is. It's just a little morsel. Yeah. So if you missed the episode, just watch the three minute corn dog moment. No, don't do that. Really don't do that. No. No. It's not mirrored, so I don't know which way is bad or what. I don't know what's going on at this point. There. Yeah, just <laughs> somewhere in the YouTube void. I mean, we could yeah. we could hire the uh, we could hire oh, the no. Ontario camera crew. You mean Florida? <laughs> no, this was from Ontario. This is more Ontario style here. More Ontario style. Yeah, get the corn dog cam. That's Florida. Oh, here we go. Oh, wait, we missed a goal. Let's go back to the main screen. Sorry. Uh, like we missed a goal there. Um, what do we do? Welcome to Ontario International Airport. Welcome to Ontario International Airport. <laughs> so when the uh, when they found out the championship was going to be played there, I very quickly kind of considered maybe going out and trying to watch it. And despite all of those advertisements, I completely forgot that Ontario had an airport. So all my research was based around, you know, finding flights in the LAX. And then I finally, then I encountered that. I was like, oh yeah, that, that was commercial. I've, I've heard of that before. <laughs> I've heard of that seven million times this last season. <laughs> and I, I see, I've seen this, you know, post come up or this con kind of comments come up over the last years and people are like, yeah, uh, you know, the blast used to run a full page ad in the Baltimore sun. No, <laughs> that's not what we mean. We need this stuff online because that's where everyone is right now. Nobody is buying the newspaper to look for Baltimore blast stuff. Who isn't already knowing about the blast and either is a fan who already goes to every game or remembers the heyday and for whatever reason, maybe they live out of the state or you know, whatever doesn't go to the game. Or mm -hmm. who is Melcher? Yeah, right, yeah, yeah. Too busy counting catalogs to people to go to a blast game. <laughs> yeah, I mean, the cool thing about the Milwaukee area is that everything's 20 minutes away. It's a city with a million people in it, but you can get to any any area from any area. We moved. Oh, must be nice. And we moved further out. So I'm, I'm 35 minutes with no traffic if I have to go downtown. But... My commute right now is about 16 seconds. My bed to my office. <laughs> That'd be nice. And if you look at their, their, their uh, attendance graph, it did this. Whoa, look, Lynn Donovan. Uh, Utica and slash Syracuse have had consistent seasons. Fine. When they hit the playoffs, they always play that one team. And I'm not going to mention who it is. And always lose. Uh, yeah. What I'm team not, is that, Matt? I don't Just know. for clarification. Uh, I don't know. I'll point <laughs> to this one. In right fact, here. It's, a, it's a funny thing you mentioned that. So I, I got this little video. That, let's play for a second. Hey, everyone. I'm Alec, and welcome to another edition of All Blast All This Week. Blast, 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 blast. And with that, I think we'll wrap up this edition of All Blast All This Week. But make sure you come back next week for another new episode. In the meantime, blast, 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 blast. <laughs> Greatest video ever.